First at five, Fong wins in court once again. State Assemblyman Vince Fong will both appear on the ballot for re-election to the State Assembly and in the congressional race to replace Kevin McCarthy. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Rochelle Mircea. Michael is off tonight. The decision coming down to just days after a court of appeals hearing last week in Sacramento. Eyewitness News reporter Leslie Molina says this ruling is not surprising to those in the courtroom last Thursday. Leslie. Rochelle Eyewitness News was the only Kern County news team in the courtroom last Thursday, and today's decision echoes an argument made by Associate Justice Peter Cross. The Secretary of State's office had argued that the elections code on your screen prevented Fong from running in two separate races. The district judge found the code does not apply to Fong since he ran as a Republican in both races. Still, the ruling was appealed by the Secretary of State, but Justice Cross appeared to agree with the district court ruling and questioned the Secretary of State's legal team for for cherry picking the statue in last week's court date. It seems to me that the secretary's reading is trying to pull one fragment or one clause out of a sentence out of context and make that a law of general application that's almost seemingly unrelated to the rest of the provision. The assemblyman finished in first place by double digits in last month's primary. Fong's attorney, Brian Hildreth, arguing last week that because the results confirmed Fong's popularity, it would not be good public policy to take him off the ballot. Now that the election has happened, that's why I think the pieces on the chessboard have changed a little bit. The power of the state is diminished in favor of the power of the, the, the particular legislative body. Body Hildreth is referring to is the U.S. House of Representatives. I will have more about this topic tonight at 11 at KBK CBS. In studio, Les Molina, Eyewitness News. Hi, I'm Rochelle Murcia with Eyewitness News Bakersfield Now on YouTube. Thank you for checking out our YouTube channel where we have tons of great content to choose from. While you're here, go ahead and click on the subscribe button right there. That way you can stay up to date on all the things related within Kern County. Thanks for watching.